What's up, YouTube? What to you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue and Red Rescue Team, episode number seven. Yeah, episode number seven with Neighbor. Say hello. Hello. He's reaching for a drink. In the last episode, we did some missions and we met Team Meanies. Those, those Meanies. Meanies. Yeah, I thought they were pretty mean, and there were some mean, there were some long S's. But if you want to go back and check that out, you can do so by clicking the i-card up at the top of the screen. In today's episode, Caterpie's here. Caterpie came to get some help, we and help <laughs> we're gonna help him. Um, first up, we got we got another mission. But anyway, if you're excited for another episode of Mystery Dungeon, make sure you hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. Let's go ahead and get to it. Have to make sure. Okay, we're good. Um, is, a, is definitely an escort me. But yes. it's only to the second floor. So we have one mission that we saved. We did some missions off uh, off screen. We saved a couple for on screen. Uh, both it's of us are heading to Tiny Woods. Uh, it is a D mission. A D rank mission. Slightly harder. I think you can't get an E ranked escort me mission. Because hmm. those are slightly harder. Client Baltoy. Who's your client? Uh, mine's a pincer. Ooh. I don't know why pincer needs my help. So you might notice on Domino's screen that there is a Pokemon on his squad that uh, has not been there. It has not been there. And it's not the ball toy. So like I said, in our off screen, uh, are we just going to run through this? I think we should just run through this. Oh, I'm going straight to the second. Yeah. Um, in the off-screen missions that we did, we wound up recruiting quite a few, and Brock joined the team. So, of course, I've got to take Brock along with me. I had a couple Pokemon. He had a couple Pokemon. Oh, wow, that was the Zigzagoon. I was about to smack it up. I'm glad I just used the A button. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I just had to take off Defense Curl. Actually, I should probably leave Defense Curl. No. I'm I not a very mile. defensive player. Oh, you're already done with this mission? Yeah. All right, hold on, I gotta get to the third floor. That earned me the special band, which I'm immediately... Actually, I sh I'm not gonna... What was that band you were telling me that you got, you have? Oh yeah, in, during my, during some of my run-throughs of stuff, I got a Parism band, which is Parism? like... How do you spell that? P-E-R-I-S-M. Like the berry. Persim? Oh, is it P-E-R-S-I-M? I think the S is first. Okay. I don't know. Persim band. By the way, it's an anti-confusion band. Which... Yeah, that's definitely Persim. Unless yeah. unless I've seen it wrong, and which is possible. Yeah. Hey but... Siri, is it Persim or Parasim? Don't answer that. I'm mad about. at you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I expected. I I ask a lot of my Siri. Hold on. Let's try again. Hey Siri, look up Persim Berry in Pokemon. Kind of. I'm giving the special ban to Izzy because Izzy actually has a special move that he can use. Whereas I do not. Stick with the Petra Scarf. Okay. Person bear. Oh, person bear. Okay. So now we've done that. I got a person band. <laughs> there you go. I could have just clicked A a couple more times and it would have oh. given me the band. All right. So. Now we're gonna we're gonna head to sleep. Or are you you're already awake the next day? Oh yeah. Whoops. Well, I woke up. Hope I don't have to restart because <laughs> it just saved. I'm gonna go ahead and accept these not steel missions while they're here because there's one and a couple stuff in there. Because if you don't accept your missions while they're there, they might not be there. You have to go talk to Brock every. Do you have to go talk to these guys yes. every day? Every day. That is the unfortunate bit about it. It doesn't save your squad, which is another quality of life change that happens in later games. Right. All right, well, I'm going to run over and accept anything that I have. Job list. I don't think I need to accept any of these right now because I'm going to create two sinister... I also have other. some mounts to... I need to yeah. run through real quick, per se. Per se. <laughs> anyway. Uh, store... Right, I'm gonna keep that. I see. Store this orange berry and then. So I'll attach the person to. Uh, 
Okay. So here we go. Off to Sinister Woods. Yes. Where it says go. Where it says go. Where it says go. Ooh. That's not very far. No, it's pretty close. <laughs> this must be it. Metapod is lost somewhere in these woods. Vanguard's gang should be in there already. We need to hurry. So this brings that. about the question of the day. There are a lot of evil Pokemon. A lot of Pokemon that are portrayed as evil in the po in the world of Pokemon. I want to know who you think the most evil Pokemon is. Come up with an answer. I don't know. There's a lot of Pokemon that are like very clearly portrayed as bad guys, but not because the Pokemon's bad. Just like the evil team has those Pokemon. Right. Issues rock throw on me. Okay, this is a dangerous pl What do I name him? Sudo Wudo! I can't name him Brock! <laughs> oh, you can name him Brock. I have, have two, two Brocks rocks. on my team! Yeah. I don't see a problem with that. What well, the last name is for. I'm gonna name him... This, this will be a girl. And his name will be Brooke. <laughs> All right, oh, we got two nice. rock types. But yeah, now we have a whole lot of people joining. Um, Ooh, th this area might be real good for your uh, TJ because there are green gummies. I think we decided that we're gonna go straight through these the first time we get to them. Right? Yeah, we should be doing that. That way we don't run out of hunger. Use rock throw. Proceed. Oh, gosh. Like, GP is even the bigger problem, because you can bring yes. a couple apples. But I have some elixirs. I'm I'm going to do all right. Oh, don't. guess I'm going to... Actually, I, pro I guess the way I should probably do this is surround, surround certain oh, Pokemon. No, you know what? Would I rather have Pseudo Wudo or would I rather have Isla Swine? Or a, a Swine Out? I would love, if it was Gen 4, I would love right, a Right, right, because you have Mana Swine. That's easily uh, one of my favorites. Look, I just picked up a Max Elix. So the game's looking out for you. Because I just picked one up, I'm going to look around. That's a Sun Floor. Ember! Or don't. Just like that, Brock grows to level eight. That's not bad. Or Brook, excuse me, Brook. Brook grew to, le grew to level eight. Oh, I've already found the stairs to Same. head to, to head to the fourth floor. I'm on the oh, third the floor. Fourth. Yeah. You are head of me. All right. I'll run. I'll run about real quick. Catch up. The radar orb scans the entire stage, or just. The entire floor that you're on. So it's best used like the second the for all the items on the earth. Pick up absorb. I learned water gun! I learned water gun! You finally learned a, a water move? Finally learned a real move. Set that right. So what I was thinking when I when, when I was thinking Geo dude, what are you doing? Brock! Brock! What happened to Brock? I don't know. He turned he just ran. Check IQ. What do you mean the move failed? Wait. Item catcher, course checker, dedicated traveler, and item master? What what do I do here? Uh I think he just got lost. Gotta go find him. Hope he runs into a loop. He, yeah. He ran into a loop. Now he's back with you. Sometimes they just get separated. Um Look at him! Why is he so much slower than you guys? Is speed even a stat? Oh dang. Brooke, Brooke doesn't need me. Take it, Brooke. So I just learned the water gun is not a long range move, and I'm upset. Brook just grew to level nine. I don't know. Brook has kind of proven himself. I think in this game, bubble is better than water gun because of its range. Like, water gun stronger.
Okay, we're... I think I'm gonna head on to the next floor because this is pretty difficult. And I don't want to die. Hey, Cole. So I'm gonna... Oh, God, look at this. Look at this floor. Look at this room. Oops, I... Okay, well... I'm on the fourth floor. I'll be there soon. And here's the stairs to go to the fifth floor. <laughs> See, the game is giving you el elixirs and reviver seeds, and that makes me think maybe we gotta keep moving. I'm gonna keep moving. I'm gonna head on to the next, because we'll be able to backtrack through here. Oh, yeah. We'll have plenty of missions, so I'm on the fifth floor. Okay, I was saying it's good for a... Uh, oh, no. TJ. Ooh, now we're getting darkness areas. I can't see... I can't see my... I can't see Brooke. Um... I'm gonna say this area might be good for TJ because I've found some green gummies on the floor. Hmm. So you could, uh. Ah. Uh, There's Sunflora be. here. Oh, I've had Sunflora since 4 2. They are pushovers. And that is a water type. Their absorb did 11 to me. Was. As long as the team stays together. I think we'll be okay. Oh, okay, so here, you want to hear who I think one of the most evil Pokemon oh, is? Oh, yeah. I think that, uh, Prodont, and I know that was one of the evil ones with Team Aqua, but from Corphish to Crawdont, Yeah, that's a big Such change. a big difference. I don't know, there's a lot of, like, easily, like, yeah, that, that Pokemon's a bad guy. But it's not really, like... I feel like Toxicroak is a super mischievous Pokemon. But, I don't know. I don't know who I think, like, the evilest is. You say Toxicroak? Is that yeah. what you said? I wonder if the reason we think those is because, like, Ash had a Corphish, Brock had a Crow Gunk. Yeah. So, like, it's hard to see those as evil Pokemon. Yeah. Brook grew to level 10. Brook learned Mimic, like... Brook is freaking leveling up. Ooh, so one reason I was just walking about, didn't walk next to this cascoon, but it woke up because it has the shed skin of everyone's at us. Hmm. But it still doesn't move because it's a cascoon. Right. That's funny. Who are you on? Uh, five. I'm on seven. Dang, you're running through. Up. All right, I won't. I won't. Uh, I've been running. I've been running. No speed up button. <laughs> Never heard of that before in my life. Sounds made up. I'm getting hungry. Who would I take with? I think I'm going to keep taking Brock. I think I'll keep bringing Geodude for the time being. I think when you have parties of four, I think they just... The person that's last just sometimes falls off. Yeah, it's big old parties make it rough. Like I'm trying to keep an eye on them because I don't want. Especially in the dark because they can't see you. They're trying their best. Is oh, this is definitely. Let's eat from my apples. Definitely. I don't know. I feel like Trico isn't gonna get lost at the back. I think Trico's just that on top of it. But now Brooke is back in the back. And I'm on to floor eight. Killing it. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna stay on here. Since you are, uh... I'm not trying to explore. I'm just having a real bad time finding these, uh... Finding Some these... floor used growth twice. Stairs. Ooh, Some floor used here. growth three times, and now it's coming after me. My you response to that is to hit. Can I get a shroomish? Can I get the shroomish? That's what I was. I want the shroomish. Yeah, sh Aww. shroomish would be great to have. Is he leveled up? Level nine. Where are your where are your squad's levels at? I guess it's a little bit easier for me to check than you. Cause yeah, all you have to do. Look up into my top screen. Is look at the top screen, which. Shroomish, shroomish, do not ember him. Yeah, I stood in the line of fire because I'm not trying to get this Shroomish Embered. Because if you don't beat the Pokemon with your leader, you can't recruit them. So that was a moot point because I did not end up recruiting. 
But... Ooh. Okay, so Brock is level 7 still. But Brook is, like, level 10. Okay. Brook... So the Pokemon that we've been running into in this area are pretty hefty. Brook's level yeah. 10 already. That means you recruited a level I 10. I almost just got hit by a water gun. Ooh, and a brown gummy. Is that... I almost type. just got hit by a water gun. That would have sucked. Does that mean orange gummies are fire type and I have not been giving them to... Why are there Lanoon here? No, don't throw stuff! Oh! Yeah, exactly! Yeah, let's go water gun. Water gun is so powerful. Holy cow! Okay, so this Lanoon just made me cringe. And I couldn't attack, so it... Like, sort of almost gave me the work. No! Brock was revived with my Reviver Seed I was carrying! Oh... No... I'm gonna need that Reviver Seed, I just know I'm going to. I found some on the floor, so maybe it's gonna, you know, provide with more, you know? Might pick up. Ooh, a blue gummy, that's for me! That's for me! I want that! Eat that right now. Brooke just grew to level 11, but Brock is still at level 7. What is happening? I don't know. All I know is I'm going on the next floor because I'm freaking terrified. I'm Ooh. on floor 9. I'm on 7. I'm about to be on 8. Go. My bag is full. There's a Scyther. Please use Ember. Oh, you didn't use Ember. Could I get a Scyther to join me? Just kidding. He got beaten up by my... Should I continue on to 410 or should I... I'm scared! Items! Travel Rock! Ah! Don't dodge! Thank you. Okay, well there are at least 10 floors. I stepped on I the last uh, I wonder if this one has a uh, resting point. I think it I I think this one actually stops you to fight the bosses at the resting point. And then yeah. later you can come back and explore. Yeah, I would totally go in those stairs. Oh, hey, because I'm a water type, I can walk in the water. But if I swap but you'll places, lose your team. Yeah. Um. This thing's just. I'm paralyzed and asleep! You are having a rough time. So you can't do anything? Oh, I would. Eat no! An, I would eat an orange berry. You are in a rough, rough spot. That is a slack off. I get that on my squad. Got it! Woo! We're having some, we're having some battles today. Are you, are you doing okay? I'm okay. doing great. I just looked over and saw... See, I don't know about you. That don't look great to me. Been great. But you on the tenth floor. Oh, you you caught up. How about you? I'm doing great. <laughs> this is my PP. Seven more. Oh shoot! I just took a big risk. There. A whooper. A whooper. Boy, do I love me some. Whoop. Rock. Go down. On floor 11 now. Okay, I'll be there in just a second. 
Obviously keep on trucking through. Hornberry, because I... Oh, his bag full. I know my bag was full. Mine's super fun. I've been picking up, like, glass seed and stuff. Poor Speaking Lego. of, I think I'm going to... There's an executor! <sighs> There's a what now? Can I get that on my squad? I would love an executor. I'm going to continue to not use my... Ooh, I just grew to level 13. And I learned Metal Claw. You learned Metal Claw? That's a dang good move. Oh, which also means that my, my, uh, that TJ grew a level. Ooh, this is scary. Uh, All right, let honestly, me look at my moves. All right, I only have 15 Metal Claw. Won't be able to. Just the, the stairs are right there. Look where I fell asleep. <laughs> All right. Luckily, nothing happened. I'm on the 12th floor. We're still going. Still going? That is a dead true. Woo! Brooke used flail and did 41. I'm going to go ahead and take a wild guess. Say that there's 13. How many blast seeds do I have? One. I'm gonna use my. Ooh, a scyther! I'm gonna move it here and like. I'm just gonna ember the scyther. Because I'm not trying to play games. I stepped on a reviver seed. Eat the apple. Yeah. Give me the reviver seed. Thank you. I'm on floor 13. On to. Yep. Yeah, okay, hold on floors. just a second. I'm on the 12th floor. Actually, I see the stairs. That flail is powerful. Woo! Brooke is already level 12. Dang, Brooke is up there. I think Brock needs to take a back seat. Chill in the friend area. Yeah, Brooke is doing Brooke, Brooke is doing is putting thing. in work. Wow, we came quite a ways into this forest. I wonder if Metapod is ahead. Hold it right there. Wait. Do we think, think it's that one? Yeah. Hold it right there. You, you know who's gonna get to Metapod first? We are! So for you to go ahead, well, we can't let that happen. What? what? Hey, Gengar! Why do you always mess with us? Oh, didn't we tell you? Our aim is world domination! <laughs> Caterpie's mama will give us a generous reward, and Caterpie will join us too! That brings us closer to our goal. And for that, your lot is in the way. I just took, I just took, I just mixed like all the voices together. Mm -hmm. So sorry to say, but your party's over right here and now. Say goodbye, d d d d OJ. OJ. Okay, so. Pause! It's time to fix the team. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna switch scratch off. I'm gonna switch. Metal switch. Sound and Actually, off. I feel like quick attack being on would be good, but I guess I just wanted to use. Clear, pound, or absorb. You're only gonna use tactics. tackle. What does mimic do? Uh, you can go for info and find out. Oh, makes the user deploy the same moves as what as the one last used by the foe facing it. The moves cannot be mimicked. That sounds too risky. But I need to move into a formation where the four of us can all be attacking. All right, are you attacking now? I'm about to throw a sleep seed. Yes, that worked exactly well. No. Oh, yep. Alright, I'm gonna... My hurl orb. The Gengar caught the hurl orb. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was worried about. Luckily, didn't didn't work out. I'm going to classy. All 
Outer shock you. That should be enough. Oh. The last move used by me lost all of its PP? Wait, 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 wait. I, just, I heard what you said and then remembered what I saw. That, that's broken. That is broken. I was at a lot, but it's okay. Because blast seeds and all that other junk is super useful. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Hold on, Magamai leveled up. <laughs> I think that was story. <laughs> oh, I need pseudo Wudo to switch spots with. Okay, thank you. You were having some trouble. I well, I couldn't get him into the battle. It's a little bit harder to maneuver around four squad members. Okay, you got the Gengar out of the way. I feel like the Gengar is the hardest part. I, I just don't the, want TJ to die. The Manu Cham does not have a lot of HP. Um. How many reviver seeds do you have? Enough, apparently. <laughs> Can you have them there? No. Oh, you can't. No. Oh, okay, so Ember is just like water gun. Yeah. Like, you can go around corners, but it's not long range. I guess flamethrower. Do Don't you do it! Don't you do it! Don't you do so it! So right now, if you want, you can set your team members' IQ. So go to team. Go to TJ, and go to tactics. And you can set it to run away, or get away. And then, remember to change that later, but that'll make him get away from the uh, fight right now, so that he's not having trouble. That was a battle, holy yeah. cow! Oh, 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 you'll pay for this, don't you forget it. Look at Man. them slithering off. No one should hold us back now, let's find Metapine. Um, excuse me. Oh. <laughs> Did you maybe come looking for me? You must be Metapod. Let's get you home. Caterpie was worried about you. Yay. I was scared, so I kept my shell hardened and waited and waited. Thank you. <laughs> this is great. Welcome, welcome back, Metapod. <laughs> Thank you, Caterpie. We don't need a reward. We're happy to see that Metapod is back safe and sound. Cool. You're even more cool than I thought. I want to go on rescues when I grow up. <laughs> That'd be great. Chase that dream. I have an idea. Domino, we should do something with this place. We should make a proper rescue team base here. Something impressive. That's cool. A, a rescue team base is cool. I want to work here when I grow up. Me too, me too! <laughs> That's what we'll do. Let's work hard and build our own rescue team base. Neighbor, Dama Neighbor and OJ, thank you again. Okay, bye, be careful going home. Please don't join our rescue team, you're both worthless. Those are two Pokemon I would not put on this one. <sighs> well, we ended up working for free, but that was the right thing to do. And we got to show Gengar's team a thing or two, so it's all good. You struggle a little more than I did. Yes. That was a tiring day. Let's do some more good work tomorrow. See you. I think that should uh, highlight the importance of using your items. Yes. Oh, goodness gracious. I think now is a good time to save. That, yeah. I don't know. I feel like... Oh, no. It says the next morning. So I imagine we wake up. And that yeah. is a more than great place to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. Got a Dang. little bit more points than I do. That was that was quite an episode. So today we started off with just a, a, a tiny woods escort me, mm -hmm. and then we went to Sinister Woods and got our butts whipped. I know I did for sure. Um, hey, if we need to grind, we know a good grind spot. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, anyway, in the next episode, we'll continue on. I imagine right now we'll be going into doing some more rescue missions until, I guess, we hit the next rank, maybe. or Maybe, or whatever the next story progress is. Right. Maybe it'll happen the second like. we move out, because we did say we wanted to expand. Oh, that's true. That's true. So we are going to be building a an upgraded base, per se. But anyway, if you wound up enjoying today's episode, make sure to hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. And while you're at it, go ahead and comment the question of the day, which was... What is the evilest right. Pokemon? What do you think is the most evil Pokemon in the game? Thank you so much for watching. Until the next episode, spread positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.